on ABC. Brought to you in part by Samsung QLED TV, the official TV of ESPN College Football. Previously in the Big 12. Historic comeback over a proud underdog. Now, three weeks later, an opportunity at redemption. Give them the very best of you. Or a repeat. Touchdown! From the teams that brought you the Big 12 game of the year. How did he do that? The highly anticipated rematch. I'm loving that. Dedicated to each other. With playoff hopes hanging in the balance. The Oklahoma Sooners, the Baylor Bears in the Big 12 Championship. You're watching the 2019 Dr. Pepper Big 12 Championship game on ABC. From AT&T Stadium in Arlington, Texas, two 11-1 teams go head-to-head. -head. It's seventh-ranked Baylor and number six Oklahoma for the conference title and perhaps a chance to play for the national championship as part of the four-team college football playoff. Hi everybody, welcome Sean McDonough along with Todd Blackledge. We'll be joined in just a moment by Holly Rowe. Delighted to have you with us for the start of a huge day of college football. Todd, anytime you play for a conference championship, it's a big game. But about 12 yeah. hours ago, this game got even bigger with Utah's loss in the Pac-12 yeah. title game. Well, absolutely. You know, Oklahoma was always going to be in that conversation at the end of the year in the playoff. Baylor might have been on the outside looking in. Not anymore. With that loss of Utah, if Georgia loses later on today to LSU, the winner of this game should and will get into the playoffs, I believe. Of course, Oklahoma looking for its fifth straight conference title. The quarterbacks change in Norman. Not much else does for the third year in a row. The Sooners leading the country in total offense, this time led by Jalen Hurts. Yeah, I think it's okay to officially dub Lincoln Riley an offensive guru because third straight transfer quarterback and all Jalen Hurts is doing is putting up the same kind of numbers as the guy before him. He's accounted for over 4,500 yards of total offense and 50 touchdowns. He's been an incredibly mature leader for this team. And the luxury he has today is in this game, he gets his number one weapon back, CeeDee Lamb, who did not play in the game at Waco. He is a big time playmaker. I expect them to get the ball to number two very early and very often. Hertz was brilliant in the second half. It was the biggest come from behind win in Oklahoma history at Baylor three weeks ago. Baylor outstanding defense you don't yeah. say that a lot in the Big 12 but it's true of this team interesting matchup against Oklahoma this is the stingiest defense in the Big 12 holding their opponents to 18.4 points per game also the greediest because they take the ball away more than ever the strength is up front their defensive front James Lynch was the defensive player of the year great numbers but the anchor is that guy that loans up in the nose guard Bravion Roy both those guys are a handful 13th in the country in scoring defense are the Baylor Bears who take the field their first appearance in the Big 12 championship game. They did win two conference titles earlier this decade when there was no title game. And Oklahoma. This is the 18th Big 12 title game. The Sooners making their 11th appearance and they've won it nine times. Baylor and Oklahoma, then the kickoff in just a moment. ESPN, home of the New Year's Six and the college football playoff. 